Now, the first time that I saw the Queen, I was a very little girl, and my family took me to London to watch the Victory Parade. And, of course, she was then the Princess Elizabeth. But I always said that the Queen, or the Queen Mother as we knew her, looked at me especially and gave me a special wave. My family thought I was fantasising, but I still believe that was true. The second time I saw her was when she did her tour of North Devon after her accession. And I was with my school, which was Barnstable Girls Grammar School, which is, doesn't exist anymore, but it exists now as Park School. And we were taken down to North Walk before the Civic Centre was there. And we stood there together, and I was beside my great friend, who some of you will know as Max. And we stood there together, and we, it was so exciting, and we watched the Queen drive by on her way to the Guildhall. Now, the next time was a very special occasion. It was the occasion of the Silver Jubilee. And we knew that there was this great event going on on Plymouth Hoe. So I decided I'd take my young children then, I think they would have been six and eight, and my mother, and we stayed on a hotel on the Hoe, looking out over the sound. And as we looked out, there moored was the Royal Yacht Britannia. Well, we watched all the ceremonies, and it was lots of marching and bands, and it was very exciting. It was the Queen, Prince Philip, and the two young princes, as they were then, Andrew and Edward. And when it was all over, and the Queen had gone away, I thought, I'm going to get as close now to the Queen as I ever were, would. And I sat on the chair where she'd been sitting which was obviously the wrong thing to do because I saw other people trying to do the same and being ushered away. But that was my closest encounter with the Queen and the last one was when she came to Exeter a few years ago and stood in the high street and watched her then. And it's been very special over the last few days. I, I've spent a lot of time just watching the people go by in Westminster Hall, and it's extremely moving. It's mesmerising. The, the time just goes, and I, I sit there and I watch, and some people bow, some people curtsy, and the little children bowing low, and then the ex-service people coming by and saluting, and. It's a very moving and a worthwhile experience if you have the chance just to sit there, perhaps just for half an hour, and share with those people who are actually there.